Welcome back, YouTube, to the next episode of the Pokemon X Plus Play. In our last episode, we made it to Sonata City and caught a Stormax. There was nothing really special about that because it took us forever to catch a Stormax anyway. Um, I did do some snooping around in Sonata City, and I did find the gym. And I did fight the trainers, but I'm here in front of the gym leader. Um, now, what I'm going to do is played with Gardevoir. It's probably gonna die. But that's fine by me. And we're gonna save once again. This way I don't have to pop Gardevoir in front every time. Well if it is a Luna. Do you remember me from Sun City? It's me, Harmony. We fought the perfection cult together. I digress. I own the city here. The gym here in Samad City. I specialize in normal and fairy top Pokemon. Do you really think you can take me on yourself? I start. I can't wait to see what you'll bring to the table. You're ready to be crushed. We're gonna start with Live Wire. It's got Skill Link. Are you seriously gonna make me flinch? Okay, there we go. That's all that matters now. Okay, knock off my Life Orb. Hmm. Agron, your turn. What did you knock off? Oh, you son of a bitch, you knocked off my leftovers. Okay. Out comes milk tank. But thanks to Lavender, we now have a shot at this. Sadly, we don't get to see Mega Milk Tank because the sprite folder. And bye bye, Agron. Oh my fucking god, this bitch! Pokemon. What we're gonna do is calm mine and hope she paralyzed for a turn. No, you body slam. And now I'm paralyzed, you fucking bitch. You're kidding me. Thank you. How is she not able to... How is she not getting parahaxed? Yeah, like for real. How the fuck is she not? I'm trying to get rid of this off now. Because there's yet to be a turn where she's paralyzed. Oh, well. That works.
Oh my fucking god. This bitch is getting on my nerves. You're kidding. You fucking survived. And hubris mount activated. But it's not gonna do much do good because <sighs> about to get dropped like a hot potato. If you don't want it. Yeah, see, like I said, drop like a hot potato. Sludge wave. What you gonna do, Sylveon? Sure, use your floor restores, I don't care. I'm quite surprised you didn't use them on your milk tank. You need to create it already. Bye bye, Sylveon. Azumarill. As much as I hated to say, we got a little that can do anything to that. Maybe Charger will have a chance. I don't know! And you just killed yourself, basically. And this is why I fucking hate Azumarill. I've lost three Pokemon to this bitch. I bet you this is where she starts doing Aqua Jet. Of course, she's not the guard of our life. Behind this now, I've already saved my fucking ass now. Oh lord. Silver. What? No, how? Ah, I lost. Unbelievable. 
Back on the first night, you I had a hunch that you would beat me one day. I guess your prediction was right. Congratulations. You can now lose two. Dazzling Green. Oh, yeah. yeah. What? Like that mouse Dragon Ball? Let me finish up. Okay. Dazzling Green isn't the best for that move, but it's one of, if not the only ones that will be bought by Ian. It's yeah. a great cover thing for your team. Next, you want to head over to Kepler City. This there is a very good. Uh, Miss Harmony? Yeah, who are you? And here's not my challenge, but that's not important. You know the hospital just north of the city? I was sent here to tell you the power just got cut. Power cut? That's impossible. To protect it. It shouldn't just fail like that. Unless it was never tall. Oh no, 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 no. I need to go check on it. Get up. There are people in that hospital in very critical condition. They need that power in order to live. Would you mind giving me a hand? Somebody really did tap dodge it. They might be dangerous, and I'd love all the help I can get. Excuse me. I almost botched that battle. Now we're better than this. Dragon Ball! Pull out a trash mon. I don't know what I'm gonna pull out because not my luck. Alright, we're gonna pull out. Alright, we're just gonna pull up, swap these out for now. And then we're gonna go check out something called the Poke Pawn. Poke Pawn, Poke Pawn, however you want to pronounce it. It's this weird thing that has an actual cooldown of like a half hour, real time. And here it is. What's the Poke Pawn? It's not what it sounds like. <coughs> it's a version of Catch a Pawn, and a chain for small captains and prizes. First, a Pokemon in your party walks in a machine. A random food is indispensable to fight them. This can range from a rare item to even a nature change. So, be careful what Pokemon you put in. You never know what nature or what will come out with. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yes, to the front of my I'm going to send in a Snowbird. Go on in, Snowbird. And we are going to get. A big mushroom? Eh. Now we have to wait a half hour before we can do this again. Um. Alright, we're gonna hold the party. It is, and this will be where we call the episode. So I hope you've all been enjoying this series. I hope to see you in the next episode. Until then, you all have a good evening. Until then, bye bye.